Hi, this is Rhonda with JRK Family Outdoors. Today we're going to show you how to season an outdoor Dutch oven. According to our manufacturer's uh, recommendations, we have taken our Dutch oven and washed it with hot water to remove the pre-coating from the factory. Now we're going to begin to coat our Dutch oven with a good vegetable oil. You can also use a good olive oil but you want to stay away from any animal fats such as lard because this can become rancid over time. We're going to take a paper towel and get a good amount of vegetable oil on it and you're going to want to wipe the inside and the outside of both the Dutch oven and the lid thoroughly with the vegetable oil. Pay special attention to the sides as well as the bottom, up over the rim, down the sides, even the feet, the inside of the lid, and the top of the lid. Okay, now we have thoroughly coated our Dutch oven with the vegetable oil. We've come out here to our outdoor barbecue grill to season our grill out here for two reasons. Uh, one, it'll be cooler instead of heating up the house inside. And two, any smoking that may occur uh, will be outside instead of inside. Uh, because you can get some uh, dripping of the oil down in your oven if you would do it uh, in your kitchen oven. So out here on the barbecue grill will work much better for us. We're going to place our Dutch oven on our barbecue grill. The Dutch oven itself is going to be turned upside down to give us a better seasoning inside and the lid off to the side. Now we're going to leave this. Our uh, manufacturer recommends 350 for one hour and uh, we always recommend that you check with your manufacturer's instructions on the temperature and time for your seasoning of your Dutch oven. Okay, we've had our Dutch oven in our barbecue grill now being seasoned at 350 degrees for an hour and we have now let it completely cool down on the barbecue grill. This has completed the seasoning process and we are now ready to use our Dutch oven for cooking. As you can see the inside is well seasoned as well as the lid and it will make a very good cooking surface for all the recipes to have in your Dutch oven. If you have any questions or comments, 
about seasoning in a Dutch oven or how to use one, click on the sidebar and visit our blog and come back for more videos. We'll have some recipes that we'll be doing in the upcoming days and weeks.